Right guys, Gaft is back. Now a quick shout out to Robert Ball Magician. There will be a link to his channel guys in a pinned comment. Go and check him out. Give him some loving, give him some likes, maybe subscribe to his channel. He's got some great tricks on there. So Rob, if you want me to upload one of your tricks guy, um, everybody on the Gaft Academy likes to know how the trick was done. So maybe send me an email of a trick you'd like me to show, one of your tricks, and then I'll send them to your channel for the reveal. How's that, bud? So, uh, Robert Ball Magician. Good guy. And a kind of improbable prediction. Spectators can shuffle the cards. When they're happy, they're all shuffled. I'm going to spread through, and I'm going to make a prediction. Look at all that. All those red cards, that's a bit weird. Let's give that a bit more of a shuffle. Give it one of these. Give it a cut. I'm going to give it one more. Good shuffle. That should hopefully be a bit better. Yeah, that's a bit better. Right. I'm going to write a prediction down. You see this paper's blank. I'll do this off screen so you cannot see. And I'll fold that up and I'll leave it in plain view the whole time. In fact, if you want to give them another shuffle. That's got to be fair. If we give it one, Triple cut, we know that's fair. Now what we're going to do is make three piles of cards. If they're black together, the two cards we'll put on one side. If they're black and red, they'll go in the middle. And if they're two reds, they'll go here. So we've got black and red and black, red and black. So we're just going to make three completely random sized piles from the spectator's shuffle. So we go through... Right, that's got to be fair. Spectator's got a choice to make either the Four of Diamonds or the Six of Clubs free choice. Let's say they go for the Four of Diamonds. Put those aside for a minute. We're now going to deal these cards into two piles. So they're remembering the Four of Diamonds. I made a prediction at the start, which is in full view. Now we're going to deal these cards onto the table. I'm going to keep dealing through. Spectator can call out stop anytime they like. So just call out stop when you want. Stop right here. Cool. The rest of the cards we'll just put with this mix. Now, I made a prediction at the start. A lot of you guys might have thought I was predicting a card. I wasn't predicting a card, but I was predicting the position your card would end up in. So I wrote the number 26. I'm going to deal to the 26th card. That's 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Oh, there was the 4 of hearts. We're looking for the 4 of diamonds. 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. No 4 of diamonds yet. 21, 22, 23, 24, 25. What would you say if this 26th card from your shuffle? Three random piles is in fact the four of diamonds. So that is a trick, guys. Make sure to smash the like button, subscribe to the Gaff Academy, post notifications on, and we'll see you tomorrow for the reveal. And make sure to check out the comment and maybe pop over to Robert Ball Magician's channel. Cheers. And let me know, Rob, send me an email, link to the trick you want me to show because they are going to want a reveal, you know. Cheers.